In this the tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use version control to use Mac. And John was using the GitHub client, but I am partial to using SourceTree, which is another GitHub client. And um, you can actually go to the Mac store and download it for free. SourceTree. See, I already have it installed. So first download that. Okay. And then we're going to go to our repo right here in the Unity Tutorials. And we're going to double click this. And we are going to go into Source Tree. And we're going to click Add a New Repo. I'm going to put that in there. And then we, I want to put this on my desktop. Desktop, and we'll call this Unity Tutorials. Okay, and we're going to clone it. So this is going to take a second to clone, so I'll pause it and I'll come back in a second. Okay, once it's set up, it's going to look like this. You're going to have that as one of your repos. And it's a good thing to note that before I can do anything besides checkout, that I need to be given access to, as a collaborator to GitHub. So make sure whoever creates the repo that they add you, or else you won't be able to push or commit to the GitHub um, repo. So the next thing we want to do is we want to start up Unity. And right now it's going to import all of the assets that you just downloaded. Um, now, it already knows that I'm using this Unity tutorial folder, but if not, you would have to do open project. But since I was just working with this before we started the tutorial up, I'll be okay, and it's just automatically going to import all of this stuff for me. This might take a little more time, so I'll uh, pause it and then I'll come back. Okay, so now you can see that we've started up Unity and we have all of the files that um, that came from the repo originally, and there's not much to it. There's this third person camera. I'm just going to show you how to do a commit with changes, so if you want, click on this third person camera. It's going to start up mono development. Okay, and once it does that, it's going to go to the third person camera and I'm just going to do something really simple. I'm just going to say uh, test change um, to commit. Okay, now we're going to want to save that and then we can minimize this in Unity and when we click on Unity Tutorials it's going to bring up our branches that we have and you're going to see that I've changed this third person camera you can see that over here change to commit and so now that we have that and we can see this what we're going to do is we're going to want to actually commit this so uh, initial Initial Mac commit um, with change to third person camera. Okay, now you can see that we have this. We're going to hit select all and then we're going to hit commit. Okay, so let's see, okay, so what that is is stage change and we're going to change that to selected files. Okay, so that's up to commit. Now we can see that it says initial Mac commit, but the last thing we're going to have to do is actually push that change. So we're going to push that to master. And we hit OK. And now you can see this is the up to date with this initial change. And just to check things, just to show you that it's changed, on that Unity Tutorials, click on it. You can see that just now I've made an initial change. We can go to assets and then let me see. Just now, scripts changed. And we have this through third person camera and we can see that it has the test change to commit. And that's really the basics.